Hello everyone, this is Tom from EverystepCalculus.com. I'm going to show you how to load my programs into your calculator. Um, first thing we do is we right click on our, on our, and we get new here, and we go up to folder, and we put Calculus 1 or whatever you're going to name the folder in here. And um, I've already done that just to save time here. So we got our folder that we're going to put the programs into, okay? And right now I want to see if the calculator is connected to the computer. I'm going to double click on TI Connect. You got to make sure that you um, load that into your computer. And I'm going to click on the on uh, make sure your calculator is connected. Make sure it's uh, I didn't have my calculator on, so I'm going to cancel out on this here. And um, click on it again. Now it's connecting. And uh, the calculator will turn off. Now you notice that it'll turn off uh, indiscriminately, so make sure you understand that. Um, here's what tells you that the computer has recognized the calculator. Okay, we're going to click out of these things. That's all in there good. And I'm going to show you how to release the memory of your calculator, which you have to do to load my programs. Uh, we're going to go second and memory here and F1 and 3 all memory. Press enter. Wait for it to dump that memory. And then we're going to do it again. Second memory F1 and then we're going to dump the flash ROM it should do that, but somehow it, a lot of times it keeps it, uh, there's something still in there which screws up my programs. And both, and then uh, enter twice, and now we're good. We're going to go back to the home screen. Okay. Now I'm going to pull up, when you click on your email, that you, after your purchase, you get this here. I'm going to click on here. And you can see where it downloads it into this area here, okay? Notice I've um, minimized this too to make it small so you can see the whole thing. So you do that by clicking on these here at the beginning to get this small. And you can move it over with the arrow key here, however you want to get it smaller. But I'm, now we're going to click on here to see my programs. And here's the Macintosh program, but here's and we got icons here. I want to see the list of them. So I go to list. And now the trick is to copy them and put them into this, into my calculator here, or the, the folder that I created. I'm going to bring this down a little bit here. So I'm going to click on the first one here, and I'm going to use the slider to go all the way to the end. Here's the last. I'm going to push the, hold the shift key down, and and left click on this port on that last program. I'm going to right click on this, and I'm going to copy them. And then I'm going to right click on this folder here, and I'm going to paste. And now they're in here. We can we can get out of the email. All these things here. I'm gonna move this up here a little bit. Notice when we click on here, we have our icons again. I'm gonna view the list, and you'll notice that I'm going to again um, highlight the first program and go to the end, hold the shift lever down, and I'm going to right click. And you notice that it says send to TI device here. If that doesn't show up, then the calculator is not being recognized by your computer. Or you haven't unzipped the files. Uh, sometimes dragging doesn't help when you drag it from the email to, to this folder. So check those things. Um, another thing is in, in, in Windows 7 and Windows 8, you, you can only highlight seven at a time and put it into, but I'm going to uh, you notice how 
TI Connect brings up this screen here, send the TI device, and notice how that lists all the programs now that I've that I've put in here. You can see it in the slider goes up here. And you have to wait for it to keep blinking and now it's all done. Okay, you notice this set to archives is not bright. Okay. So we're going to click on this top one here and highlight that. We're going to take the slider, go all the way down to the bottom, hold the shift le lever down again, and left click on that. Notice that this became bold now. So we can click on that and change the RAM, change the RAM over here to archives. That was what we did. And then we're going to just press send to TI device and it'll start loading them into the calculator. And notice, there's, notice that there's 148 programs, so there's quite a bit here in calculus 1, 2, and 3. And it'll take some time, but uh, after they're loaded, you can put index 8 into the uh, calculator home screen and up will come the my main menu and, you, and you're on your way to passing calculus. Uh, okay, good. EverystepCalculus.com. Go to my site, buy my programs, and look for movies, too. Subscribe to me so you can get future movies, etc. Have a good day.